got off, we just got off stage from doing our first set. You can hear the noise out there in the restaurant. It's packed, and we're gonna have some pointers on how to dance in a restaurant setting when everybody's looking at their food instead of the dancer. Ah! So we just finished our first set at Alfredo's Mediterranean Grill, and this is completely different for me because one, I've always danced with some form or another of Dada Brox, the live band, or other live music. So it's ironic, but for me, dancing to recorded music is really hard. It's like out of my comfort zone. You and the musicians learn to work together. You cover each other for mistakes. We went out there and my shoes, which I normally wear these shoes on carpet, totally, totally slippery. So these shoes that work on most surfaces were completely slippery. And that's happened before in my early days where it was like totally freaked me out. Well, I got out there and I thought, should have checked my shoes. I usually do that, but I'm like carpet, these are my carpet shoes. But anyways, so the cool thing is when you go through those mistakes is that you learn from them and you learn, okay, I'm not gonna be able to go all out in my spins because it's gonna be too slippery. So I'll just chill and I'll have fun with my hip drops or something else where I'm not having to move so much so I don't lose my balance. The other unnerving thing is usually when we do shows, it's a show, it's advertised, people are coming to see us as much as the meal. Here, people are, there's people holding up their phones and stuff, but a lot of people are checking their phone and they're eating and they're not paying attention. But on the one hand, it's great because it's like, it doesn't matter if you mess up. But on the other hand, it can be like, oh my God, I worked so hard, why aren't you watching? Again, in my earlier days, when I first started out, it was like devastating. Now I'm like, this is great. Everybody's having a good time. I'm gonna just have fun with this. In the situation you're in, there will always be something that you didn't expect. Your shoes go wrong, people aren't watching, the music's not right, it's not loud enough. But if you can go with the essence of belly dance, which is being in the moment with the music and enjoy even just one tiny little thing, like if you feel totally freaked out, well, I really like being in my costume or the lighting is really pretty and try to focus on that, relax and have fun with one little tiny thing and then it'll spread. If you like this video, please consider subscribing because we have lots more stuff. You can check out our Billy Dance Breaks tutorials which go in detail about how to do certain moves and we'll have lots more. And this is the green room, the changing room. And this is actually one of my favorites, although it doesn't have a mirror because look at the backdrop. It's awesome.